You got a bunch of guys about to turn blue. We're breathing again. Thanks a lot. Well, a funny thing happened on the way to the moon. That's the title of a video that I watched on YouTube. You can see astronauts hanging from wires, proving that astronauts are NASA are liars. They analyze photos and highlight mistakes with the moon landing missions. They show it was faked. You can see them faking the photos of Earth. They use a round window to fake the curve. Hmm. Well, that's suspicious, don't you think? Yeah, listen up. I watched another documentary called Astronauts Gone Wild. Astronaut Buzz Aldrin gets a little riled. All he was asked to do was to swear to God that he went to the moon, but he would not. He was faced with a moon landing denier. Had a chance to show that he ain't no liar. But Buzz decided to punch that dude just for asking him to swear if he went to the moon. That's suspicious. So, do you still believe we went to the moon? Do you still believe what they're telling you? Just connect the dots and pretty soon you'll find out what I found out too. But if you question this stuff, you'll be labeled a loon. You'll be called a conspiracy theory buffoon. But I don't care, man. I'm still gonna make this too, cause I know that we didn't go to the moon. What if you swore in the Bible that you walked on the moon? You're the one who said you walked on the moon when you didn't. And how about those moon rocks they gave to museums? And thousands and thousands of people did see them. But one museum took a closer look. They soon realized that something's afoot. The rock they were given turned out to be a fake. Just a piece of old wood, not a rock from space. Yeah, when God made the moon, he saw it was good. But apparently made it from petrified wood. Hmm. Yeah, that's suspicious. Listen up. In another museum sits an astronaut suit. Take a good look at the tread on the boot. It doesn't match up with the prints on the moon. And y'all still believe what they're telling you? Or how about that phone call that Nixon made to the moon that's a quarter million miles away? When I can't get a signal on my cell phone line, I guess phones were better in 69. Hmm. Well, do you still believe we went to the moon? Do you still believe what they're telling you? Just connect the dots and pretty soon you'll find out what I found out too. But if you question this stuff, you'll be labeled a loon. You'll be called a conspiracy theory buffoon. But I don't care, man. I'm still gonna make this too, because I know that we didn't go to the moon. And it certainly has to be the most dishonest telephone call. Never made the yeah, you went straight through those Van Allen belts. It wasn't a problem, right? Nothing was felt. But now you say it's a problem and you can't get through. This problem needs to be solved, according to you. But didn't you solve that problem back in 69 and you flew straight through them five more times? Uh, you wonder why I think it's fake when there are so many Apollo mistakes like the telemetry data that's all gone missing. 13,000 reels, are you kidding? A giant leap for all mankind, but you lost the data and no one can find. Hmm. Come on, man, are you kidding? Do you still believe we went to the moon? Do you still believe what they're telling you? Just connect the dots and pretty soon you'll find out what I found out too. But if you question this stuff, you'll be labeled a loon. You'll be called a conspiracy theory buffoon. But I don't care, man. I'm still gonna make this too, because I know that you can't go. No, there's no blast crater from the lunar module. Probably because that thing is just a model. Or the flag that flutters with no atmosphere. <laughs> Don't you think that's a bit queer? Intersecting shadows means another light source. Do I think it's fake? 
Yeah, of course. The whole thing was filmed on a Hollywood set. Directed by Kubrick is my best bet. The moon's so cool, we'd love to explore it. But we can't get past low Earth orbit. Do your research, people, I think you'll find. But NASA admits that a bunch of times. Listen. Right now, we only can fly in Earth orbit. That's the farthest that we can go. And this new system that we're building is going to allow us to go beyond and hopefully take humans into the solar system to explore. So the moon, Mars, asteroids, there's a lot of destinations that we could go to. And we're building these building block components in order to allow us to do that eventually. I'd go to the moon in a nanosecond. Uh, the problem is we don't have the technology to do that anymore. We used to, but we uh, destroyed that technology and uh, it's a painful process to build it back again.